Uh, that was a decent first run through. Yeah, let's go with that. Um, my biggest note is that there needs to be more orbiting from the ensemble. Let's take a 10 minute break, okay? 10 minutes. Thank goodness my mom gave me this reusable straw so I can use it while, while uh, in my costume. It just sucks. I don't have time to take off all this during our breaks. I had to go to the vending machine, looking like this, and all the kids on the ping pong team saw me. I was mortified. I don't want to hear you complaining. This is practice for when we have to wear the costumes for a full two hours on stage. Besides, you signed up for this. I didn't sign up for this. You signed me up for this. I wanted to do ping pong. Okay, well, I I wanted you to witness the wonderful works of William Shakespeare. Uh, and he, he, he's the greatest, greatest person in the universe. Okay, I get it. Billy Shakes is your favorite. But to be honest, when you said we would sign up for an ensemble of Hamlet in Space, this wasn't exactly what I expected. Yeah, I really didn't think they were going to take the whole space theme literally. Uh, yeah, you think? Well, I thought that when we signed up for the ensemble, they were going to give us uh -huh. some... I thought they were going to give us some bit parts. I didn't think that they were actually going to make us be planets, but at least we get to be the best planets. What makes Jupiter and Saturn the best planets? I don't know, but they're definitely the biggest. Don't rub it in, Kara. Wow. Oh, oh my god, you scared me. I've been standing here this whole time, and it's Rolf, by the way. Rolf? Are you sure? Yes, I'm sure it's my name! I was named after the hero character in The Sound of Music. No, what now? I don't think you watched the end of that movie, dude. Whatever, Kara. You don't have to be mean to me just because I'm playing Pluto. Oh, ouch. I didn't know they gave you Pluto, buddy. Yeah. I'll have you know. I'll have you know I have over a dozen Shakespeare credits to my resume, including Romeo and Juliet, Paleolithic Era, Much Ado About Nothing Happening in the Shopping Mall, and Richard III in the Bull Pit. Well, damn. And for your information, Pluto was given the status of dwarf planet by the International Astronomical Union in 2006. Well, damn. Yeah. Don't feel bad for him. Last, he has a thick skin. Last year, he played the part of a full floating in uh, our rendition of The Tempest, colon, The Natatorium. I just didn't know the little weirdo knew so much about space. It kind of makes me want to appreciate my role a little bit more. See, I knew that being in the arts would make you appreciate the works of William Shakespeare. Eh, not really. But I guess space is the next best thing to ping pong. <laughs> 